What if you could use N8N and AI to generate engaging videos with your own personal avatar with AI B-roll just like this? So I'm calling this project AI video plus B-roll magic. On the left-hand side here, we can see all of the active videos that we're working on. And then we also have some views along the left-hand side here that allows us to facilitate our automation triggers. But basically the way this works, you just add a new video. This checkbox here allows you to control which is the active video, which is nice when you're working with your different segments so that you're only seeing the segments of the video you're working on instead of all of the segments, which looks a little bit more overwhelming like this. So if you notice, if I click on this here and jump back to segments, all of the segments are going to disappear because we haven't actually generated any yet. We can put in a description and then you can add in your script for the video. Of course, you could auto generate this as well. It's going to have a default width and height. Of course, you can change that if you want. Once you have the script in here, you can go ahead and click this checkbox to actually generate the AI video. That's going to trigger a backend automation here, which is going to reach out to HeyGen to turn that script into a AI video. Notice if we skip through it, it doesn't have any captions. It's not going to have any music. And the service I'm using to create these AI videos is HeyGen, and you can see that our new video is now processing. So from here, what's going to happen is we are going to generate an SRT file. What that allows us to do is it takes the transcript and it breaks it up so that we have timestamps for the different segments of the video. We know exactly what time to add those B-roll videos to the timeline of the video. And then from that SRT file, you can see that it's generating these different segments here. So basically, we have the transcript of our video broken out by different start and end times and the duration of those different segments to allow us to decide which segments of the video we want to add B-roll to. So here, if I wanted to create B-roll on this segment here, I would simply check B-roll. Now what the system is going to do is that it's going to come down this automation here. It's going to generate an AI image prompt. It's going to request that image to be generated, and then it's going to go ahead and update our Airtable database. And then once it has that AI prompt, it's going to fall into this view here to actually generate an image. Now that we have that image, we could take a look at the different options, and then we could pick one. In this case, I'm going to go with image two. Then what we'll do is upscale that image to a full resolution. And then from there, it's going to go down this path here where we create an actual video from the image. Then once that video is generated, it'll pop back into Airtable where it is now animated. And then once you finish generating all of the videos for each segment that you want to create, you can jump back to videos. And from here, we can assemble and overlay the B-roll over the original AI video by clicking this checkbox. This is going to trigger automations in the background to combine the video and the B-roll together in this automation here. Once that B-roll has been overlaid on the original video, it's going to use these other views to trigger additional operations to generate the AI music, then to mix the video and the music together, and then finally to add captions to the video. And as you can see now, we have the video and the captions. We could play the video. I'm Steven's AI avatar. Notice in this video, we can seamlessly add AI generated B-roll. We can also add AI generated music as a backtrack video with overwrite. captions. So there you go. Make sure to check out the No Code Architects community. I'd love to see you there. Either way, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next one.